fans of Netflix's hugely popular series Emily in Paris can rejoice. Filming for the second season has wrapped up, and we are looking forward to finally seeing Emily roaming the streets of Paris again on our screen. Here's what we know about the series so far. Since the show debuted on Netflix, it has been watched by more than 50 million people, and that's quite impressive to say the least. In 2002, it was one of the most streamed shows, right behind The Saucy Bridgerton and Tiger King and The Queen's Gambit. People weren't surprised when the streaming giant announced that it would be renewing the show in November. In true Emily fashion, Lily Collins announced that they have wrapped up filming via the character's most beloved social media platform, Instagram. The star couldn't believe that filming had come to an end. She wrote, Being in Paris with my family and with this cast and crew over the last four months and on set for 67 days has been the most memorable experience, and I will cherish every second of it. Earlier in the week, she also shared a photo of her and co-star Ashley Park, letting everyone know that she was crying on their last day on the set. While the release date for the second season is yet to be confirmed as of this writing, the end of filming is just a reminder that we're a step closer to finally seeing the cast reunite on the screen. How was the second season announced? News broke on the internet through Netflix's official Twitter account. In November 2020, Netflix shared a video of the stars saying the French word de, which means two in English, and it came with the caption, Emily and Paris will return for season two. Since then, fans couldn't wait to see the cast reunited once again. What is the plot for season two? If you saw the finale of season one, it was a cliffhanger, and people had many questions questions in their mind. We expect plenty of drama for the second season. One of Emily's love interests, Gabriel, decided to stay in Paris after Antoine offered to purchase his restaurant. However, Camille, who happens to be Emily's good friend and Gabriel's girlfriend, said she wanted to talk to our main star. Well, plenty is certainly going on. It got fans thinking, if Camille knew that there is something going on between Gabriel and Emily, what will she do? What does she want to talk to Emily about? Emily's charm has taken her far in Paris, however, her personality has rubbed some people the wrong way. But will things still work to her advantage in the second season? She and her boss Sylvie seem to have patched things up at the end of the first season. Will they become fast friends and enjoy Paris together in season two? It still remains to be seen. The official statement for season two came in the form of a letter from none other than Sylvie herself. It was sent to Emily's American employer, and the letter said that they wanted Emily to remain in Paris because she's made quite the impression on clients. But Sylvie asked Emily's employer not to let her know. In season two, we can expect Emily to settle into life in Paris. She'll be more of a resident instead of a tourist, and we will see her making a life in the City of Lights. The show's creator, Darren Starr, even hinted that the relationship between Emily, Camille, and Gabriel will evolve as the show moves to the second season. The relationship between the three characters will be explored further. It will be like looking at everything through the lens of French people. Suffice to say that things will be very interesting. It's a given that Emily's love life will take center stage on the show, but her friendship with Mindy will also be explored further. At the finale of season one, we saw the two two friends moving in together after Mindy lost her job as an au pair because she wanted to follow her dreams in Moonlight at a drag bar. There's certainly a lot of material for the second season to look at. Who will we see in season two? Will some characters be leaving? Will there be new characters introduced? If you've seen the teaser clip for the upcoming season, which Netflix released, we will see all of the show's main characters coming back for season two. And that's music to our ears. That means Lily Collins, Lucas Bravo, Ashley Park, Samuel Arnold, Camille Rosat, Philippine Leroy Bolu, and Bruno Gori will be gracing our screens. Everyone's favorite perfume company founder, Antoine, played by William Abadi, will also be coming back, and he has just been promoted to series regular. So we'll see plenty more of him hanging around Sylvie, as well as Emily. Oh yeah, 
Let's not forget that he's also an investor in Gabriel's restaurant. Lucien Laviscant has been cast as Alfie, and he will have a recurring role in the series. He's described as a charming and sarcastic cynic who doesn't want to speak French and doesn't like French culture. He will be teasing Emily to no end, and they will have an antagonistic relationship that evolves into something more. Alfie is currently in Paris as an employee of a UK bank. A few new names joining the cast are Arnaud Ben who play a nightclub owner, Lauren G, who comes across Emily when he agrees to promote one of the brands she's handling, and Jeremy O'Harris, who'll take on the role of Gregory Elliott Dupree, the former protege of Pierre Cadeau, who is now an iconic fashion designer. Is the trailer available yet? We sure would like to see it now. Unfortunately, there's no trailer yet. In the meantime, you can just watch the teaser from Netflix, which has been posted on their official Twitter account. What are you waiting for? Check it out! When can we watch the second season? We can't wait to catch it. And we can't wait to see more Emily in Paris, donning her fashionable outfits and having lots of adventures. We are sad to say that we might need to wait a while before we can finally binge watch season two. The show won't be gracing our screens soon. Despite the fact that season two was announced in November last year, it had to be shot on location, and the cast and crew had to navigate the ever-evolving situation with COVID that affected the whole world. The show, just like most other shows and movies, was also affected by delays and only just started wrapping up filming. We just can't wait to say bonjour, Emily. Will Emily have to choose between Gabriel and Matthew? One of the major cliffhangers of the first season left fans wondering which guy Emily would pick. Are you Team Matthew or Team Gabriel? We're leaning towards Gabriel more, but our opinions certainly don't matter. The cast and crew have their own ideas as to which guy ends up with Emily or not, and that's what we've been wanting to find out. It's a given that Emily will have a few complicated choices to make with regard to the men in her life. Gabriel has been the primary relationship, but she's also friends with his girlfriend Camille. Emily seems like the type of girl who wouldn't want to betray a good friend, so there's that. We also haven't seen the potential of the relationship between Matthew and Emily yet, so we have to brace ourselves for a surprise. Then there's the deal between Antoine and Gabriel, which might cause a lot of trouble. Star, the creator, mentioned that Antoine has ulterior motives and he's not a very trustworthy person. Him wanting to work with Gabriel might result in something dangerous. Speaking of Gabriel, his relationship with Camille is rocky. They've been arguing a lot lately, and the fact that her family has offered to help with his business is not doing any good. He's always wanted to be a self-made chef, and he wants to make it on his own. At the end of season one, it seemed that he was drawn more to Emily and the promising opportunities that come with her. He and Camille might truly be over. How will Camille react when she finds out about Emily and Gabriel? Emily and Camille have walked the streets of Paris together and even shared a bed, as well as a kiss. What will the revelation about Gabriel and Emily do to Camille? Will it destroy their friendship? There's a possibility that Camille might get more upset with Emily. After all, she considers Emily a very dear friend, and to think that Emily has done plenty of things behind her back. She welcomed Emily, showed her the ropes, and helped her many times times. Although we might expect her to get upset, we don't think she will be upset for long because she loves Emily. They might just talk and work things out. They need to understand the reasons behind their actions because ultimately we think that Camille wants to stay friends with Emily and the feeling is mutual. We can't wait to see the show's new fashions. Some photos from the set are interesting to say the least, and a few of them seem to be inspired by the 60s. The paparazzi had also caught a shot of Lily Collins wearing wearing a red miniskirt and a puff sleeve peplum top. Of course, she's wearing heels, too. We can't wait to see what sort of fashions they come up with. We're sure we can learn a thing or two from the fashion department. What are you most looking forward to in season two? Do you want to see Gabriel and Emily get together? But what about Camille? We'd love to know what you think. This is the end of our video, folks. We'll see you again next time.